This week, Israeli Foreign Minister Yair Lapid is hosting Greece and Cyprus and has welcomed the alliance that is emerging across West Asia and the eastern Mediterranean region. The alliance includes long-term allies Greece and Cyprus. The two countries, Egypt and Jordan, that were the first to have diplomatic relations with Israel, as well as the first two countries to sign the Abraham Accords, the UAE and Bahrain. Lapid said that this is a key part of the change that is happening in the region, a moderate, pragmatic and forward-looking alliance. Greek Foreign Minister M. Nikos Dendias said, that their discussions covered climate change and civil protection, as well as extremely worrying developments in the wider region. In a statement released on Sunday, Prime Minister Bennett said there are many issues the countries can cooperate on and suggested that the aim was to build a coalition to block Islamic and Iranian extremism. This coming week and month are likely to be very important for Israel and for the entire West Asia region. Firstly, it's Naftali Bennett's first overseas trip since becoming PM and his first meeting with President Biden. He's also planning his first visit to meet Egyptian President El Sisi. Could we be seeing a new push for normalization as part of a growing alliance to counter extremism and Iran's influence in the region? Time will tell, but in the meantime, the tea will keep brewing and so will the discussions. This is Jody Cohen from the PM's residence in Renana, Israel for We On, World Is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.